Hi, this is Blake, and I'm going to demonstrate how to take map data that I generated offline and merge it into existing OpenStreetMap data. And so you can see on my screen I have an area. Because this is a demonstration, I'm going to do things a little bit differently, but typically I would, I would come to this area and I would say download, and I would download all of the data from OpenStreetMap to this area, and I'm just going to turn on. I, I did that a little bit earlier, so I'm just going to turn that on now. And this is what I would see. Um, and my buildings are not very well aligned with my imagery. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to align my imagery. And I'm using the Digital Globe Premium Imagery Layer. If you look over to the right, that's the only one that's activated. So I'm going to align that. And this goes pretty fast. Um, it might not get exact alignment, but there we go. Now it matches the existing data. And so now I also have a data layer that came from my own surveys. And I have these three new buildings that were on my data layer. And typically what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over and I'm going to say Tools. And I'm going to come down here and And normally I have a merge. I should be able to merge one layer into the next, but I'm stymied. Um, why I don't have, normally I have one of these things that lets me merge a layer. There we are, it's under edit. I'm going to say merge and I'm going to merge all the data from my, from my layer that I generated offline onto my data layer from OpenStreetMap. This is the data layer from OpenStreetMap, that's the data layer from OpenStreetMap, and I'm going to say merge. And now all of that has been copied over to OpenStreetMap data. So I can see that this stuff doesn't line up very well, but I can be pretty sure that um, you know, this is my building. It has my own tags on it, residential, Blake's OMK data. This is the other one that's my data. These are the objects that aren't saved. These are the existing objects. So I can do this in a couple of different ways. I can, you know, th this building's already mapped. So what I can do is I can come over here to this, I can select this object, and I can come up here and I can say copy tags, and then I can select this object, and I can say edit, and then say paste tags. And you can see it's replaced the building tag and it's added my thing. The important thing is it keeps the history. That's the reason that we want to do this is because somebody else mapped this. It's in the bot. We're here the building that I copied from this one anymore because I put its tags onto the object. And I could do that again. I could come over here. There's keyboard cuts for this that you could learn or you could add um, in your preferences. But I would copy the tags and I would select the right building and I would paste the tags. The other one that I have that's even a little bit easier is replace geometry. So this is the building that goes with the building that's already mapped. And I can just select. I'm clicking on this building, and then I'm going to hold down my Shift key, and I'm going to select the new building. And I'm going to come up to More Tools, and I'm going to choose Replace Geometry. And what this is going to do is it's going to take the existing building from OpenStreetMap, and it's going to merge it into my new building that I just did the merge from my previous layer. So I'm going to choose Replace Geometry. Um, and it tells me if there's a conflict, I can certainly say, yes, I want this to be residential. And then I say apply. And you can see my building, the original building from OpenStreetMap disappeared. So my last step is to just take my new building and put it in the right place. And that's it. So now we've had two different ways that we can conflate. This is called conflation. That we can conflate new information with existing information. And you can decide which one works best for you. I personally think copying and pasting the tags is a little bit faster. And like I said, you can copy the tags and then choose paste the tags. And that, you know, you don't even have to go through the dialog and then just come back here and get rid of the, you know, the new building that you don't need to merge in anymore. And that's it. I've conflated all this data. It all looks right. I would just click on upload if this were a typical scenario and it would be uploaded to OpenStreetMap and it would be done. That's it. Thanks very much. Bye bye.